right then. Regulatory framework for death! <laughs> Never bring a spear to a fist fight! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. I can't just leave him. He's gonna get really hurt. Hey, Tuber Goobers! Back off! Stay out of this, girl. We got plenty of unresolved anger issues to go around. What do you even want with him? He's just a kid! Hey, kids can die just as easily as anyone else! Yeah. We're a non-discriminatory criminal organization. So we won't hesitate to hit a little girl either. Right, Duke? Right. Vacation Maggie's going on vacation. Potato sack, sweetheart. Proud boy, you're gonna die in the line of duty. Right. Ice cream really is dangerous business. Okay, here's a plan, Terrace. Wait until they're distracted, brutally murdering me, then you run away and hide. Also got this. Let's go, boys. We'll finish the job some other time. Hey, get back here! Ah! Relax. He's probably locked himself in the safe again. Well, I guess he's dead. So what's the scheme? Spook him and smash in? No, I spied Slack security, so we should... Slip in stealthily and stick him while this squad is squabbling? Smart, Slick. It's all right. Oh! Stupid son of a... Oh dear, Duke. Departed too soon. Sometimes I can still hear him screaming. <laughs> Good to see you alive, Duke. Atta boy! I knew you weren't dead. And you even brought the deputy right to us! That's right! But he did it so we could mash your taters! He's on our side now! He's gonna be... a musician! Duke, is this true? Sorry, guys. They gave me a way out. Duke, how could you? After all we've been through, you gonna sell us out for a song, Dookie boy? <laughs> Dookie. Remember growing up together in the potato patch. Literally dirt poor. Or all the times we had each other's backs fighting the asparagus army. And all the fun we had together looting and pillaging those children's hospitals. You're right. I knew we should have just blowtorched him. What about your talent, Duke? Are you just gonna throw that away? What about your dreams? 
just dreams. Ah! Supervisor! No! You monsters! Don't worry, deputy. You'll be rendezvousing with her soon enough. Anybody stay dead today? <laughs> Come on, garbage. Recycle something good for me. Supervisor says, suck it, spuds. Wrong, deputy. Uh, just the bit. was out, but they pulled me back in. It's hard to turn your back on your family. I understand. I know all too well what it's like living up to family expectations. If you want your suitcase, it's over there. Supervisor, should we go after her? Nah, it's getting late. Come on, let's get rid of this trash. <laughs> oh. Look on the bright side, Supervisor. We beat a whole criminal gang today. Yeah, but I'm back to square one on getting my stuff back. Or on the bright side, we have another adventure. To go in together! Stop sweating, Supervisor! We'll snag that suitcase swindler! <laughs> sure. And now for our next act it's the Aura Bora Beep Boy Brothers with their hit song, Don't Ever Give Up on Your Dreams. Let us out, Duke! This ain't funny! I don't know, it's kinda cozy, like a mother's warm embrace. How would you know, Mass? You never had a mother. Doing my rounds, doing my rounds. Hey, 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 just doing my round. <laughs> my life is a failure. My wife hates me and I'll never achieve my dream of dancing professionally. <laughs> the dog says. Attention all exhibits. Please enter. Defense mode. Supervisor, Our hunch was correct, Deputy. Whoever stole this artwork is the same thief that stole my suitcase yesterday. Take those sunglasses off, we're indoors. Sorry. A thousand apologies for my lateness, Detective, and small child. Hey! Don't call her a small child! I am the curator of this fine museum. How may I assist you in recovering my stolen portrait of the manly and well-respected Sheriff Aloysius Bory? Wait. 
Aloysia Spory? The manly and well-respected Aloysia Spory? You're talking about my pop-up! Uh, I can fix that. We found the criminal's mask at the crime scene. Seen anything like this before? I'll just slip this in. As a matter of fact, I have. I can look into it a little further if you like. Oh, now it's everywhere! Thanks. Any clues at all would be really helpful. Whoa! <laughs> Ori, get off me! Sorry, sorry, sorry! I think I've glued us together. Well, isn't that great? Who in the name of the avant-garde art movement are you? Oh, we're the same investigators from before. My sticky boy. I, the only curator of the Port Aurora Museum of Replica Artwork, can assure you that I have never seen you before in my whole life. Wait, you're the curator? Then that means the person we were talking to before was... A hobo? No, it has to be... The Burglar! They took their disguise off. Roger that. Suspect is naked. I repeat, but naked. She's over here! No, behind you! Huh? No, the other way! Huh? Ugh, I can't see anything in here. Keep following me, and next time will be worse. Uh, uh, we lost her and the mask. We'll never track her down now. Don't speak too soon, Supervisor. The thief left a calling card. You mean like a trademark or something? No, I mean a literal calling card. Must have slipped out of her pocket. Hmm... She's gone. She must have left in a hurry, though. Pop-Pop's still here. Something's not right. <laughs> I told you it would get worse if you followed me. Ori? Where'd you go? Ori? He's not the one you should be worrying about. What's wrong? Scared to face yourself? Supervisor! Supervisor! Hello, Ori. Pop Pop? <laughs> You're not real! Go away! Why? I'm the only one who can put up with you. Shut up, shut up, shut up! Perfect Maggie, pushing everyone away because no one is ever good enough. I mean, that's why you didn't bring any of your friends on this vacation, right? Because they'd screw up your perfect plan? <laughs> and you wonder why you're always alone. Pop Pop, I'm sorry! Don't pop up me, you disappointment of a descendant. I was Aloysius Bory, the manly and well-respected. What are you, Ori the deputy? You're not fit to be the sheriff, and even you know it. I'm just a kid. Bah! When I was your age, I was hunting razor squids by day, fighting criminals by night, and romancing beautiful women in the afternoon. You can't protect this island like I did! I know. I know. But that's why I have the supervisor! <sighs> the supervisor's smart and capable. And she's tough and strong. She literally carried me all the way here. Ori, is that you? He doesn't know the real you. You'll push him away like everyone else. Shut up! I'm listening to this. <gasps> Supervisor, I've always got your back. So long as you're willing to stick around, of course. Of course I will, Ori. You'll be neither, cause you're weak! You're still the same person you always were. 
I don't care what you think! Ah! <sighs> <sighs> well, that was terrifying. Yeah, but at least we're safe now. Oh, holy laser guns! <laughs> Grappling hook, Ori. Oh! Well, I guess you got away again. Yeah. But the important thing is... I finally got my suitcase back! And the portrait of my dead hero grandfather. Yeah, that too. <laughs> Supervisor, you okay? It's empty! She already took everything! <laughs> Wait, so this means you and I are going on another adventure. Yay! Yeah! and Ori, partners forever, hanging out and solving crime. I, I, I. Let's go, deputy. Come on, Pop Pop. Let's put you back in the museum where you belong instead of inside the twisted halls of my subconscious. Hello, Whisk. <gasps> yeah, I'm watching you and... Hey, hey! What did I say about not waving? Uh, where was I? Oh, yeah. I was checking in to find out why... You had a run-in with a deputy before the job you were actually hired to do! Uh, I was just... Uh, I didn't think that there was a pain there again! Was a, there was a... Where, where, where? Whisk! Do you know what a low profile means? <laughs> I presume from your trousers soiling silence that you don't. It means not doing anything until the plan goes down at the Phoenix Festival. <laughs> now, I don't want to hear any more trouble from you, kitty cat. Got it? Y yes sir. Good. What are you hanging around for anyway? N nothing. Well, get going then before somebody else sees you. <sighs> you have taken something from us, Frauleins. Now we will make you disappear. What's the plan? Just get to the center of the room. Tight, tight, bristle shots. That won't work twice, my Navixen. <laughs> oh, no, not again! <laughs> Good job, my man. This is for you. And this is yours. Yes! Finally! What's so special about that camera, anyway? Hey, you got your coping mechanisms, I got mine. Whatever. You know, we make a great team. Maybe we can work together again on something bigger in the future. But this is your last heist. You're starting a new life after this. Yeah, a new life where I steal for myself and not other people. Oh, you thought I meant stopping entirely? <laughs> <sighs> Whisk. Oh, I, I mean, sure, I'll stop eventually, once I make enough to retire. I mean, who knows what the future holds? I do know what your future holds! It's jail! <laughs> what? Ori? Deputy? Yes, it is I! Deputy Ori! But how did I foil this scheme, you ask? We never asked that. Well, let me start from the beginning. I thought it was strange that the supervisor would leave without me. So, I decided to follow. As soon as I managed to extract myself from my musical predicament, 
I trusted the supervisor, but I knew that you were a tricky one. So, I neutralized your threat by taking your weapon away. <laughs> by the way, she was hiding under the chair, supervisor. Oh. Next was to neutralize you. And I knew your mask was your weakness. And don't take people's stuff, it's wrong. Huh. Why'd you have to disguise as a woman, though? And finally, to cut off your getaway. Ingenuity and intelligence wins again! That was actually really impressive, Deputy. <laughs> Thanks. I'm sorry. I swear I'll never steal again. Please let me go. After you tricked the supervisor, robbed a bunch of people, and tried to attack us, no way! Sorry, Whisk. Maybe a timeout will be good for you. You'll have time to figure out who you really are. <sighs> Mash, for the last time, get the fork out of my face! Oh, that's not my fault. <laughs> they got you too, huh? Yeah. Think the boss is going to be mad? Probably. So, the criminals locked up, we returned the money, and you got your thing back. I guess this means you're gonna continue your vacation now, huh? I actually wanted to talk to you about that. I came to this island for fun and adventure. And hanging out with you, I've actually had a lot of fun and adventure. <gasps> so, maybe I'll stick around and keep helping out around here, partner. Uh-huh, uh-huh, yeah! <laughs> hey, Ori, say woomy vroomy. Woomy vroomy! You know, Supervisor, oh, I mean, partner, <laughs> if you wanted a camera, I could have just given you one. Oh, thanks, but it's not the camera that's important. It's the memories in it. Whenever I get upset, I just have to look at them, and it always makes me feel better. Relax, girl. The real show hasn't even begun yet. Yeah, you'll be dancing to our beats soon enough. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of which, Freddy, how's Phase Two looking? Functional, Frankie. <gasps> Shame what's gonna happen to her. She seemed like such a nice girl. I mean, it's either her or us, man. May as well be her. Yeah, unless you want to be the one to assassinate the mayor! What? Assassinate the mayor? But, but you're the funky force. Why would you... <laughs> you have a brainwashing room and plans for my partner. Are you guys villains? We tried being heroes when we were young. It didn't work out. Huh? There were people that were counting on us. Oh. And we found that playing heroes? Why, well, that's a lot easier than actually being one. But you can't be a hero without a villain. And sometimes, those are in short supply. So, we make our own. Uh, uh, what time is it? It's like you massage the inside of my brain. Come now. We're going to bring you to a special room where your training will begin. <sighs> oh, okay. I guess we'll meet Ori there, right? Partner, no! It's a trap! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, don't worry. We'll help her. We are heroes after all. Yeah! <laughs> you 
got a lot of heart, kid. You actually remind me of us when we were younger. I want to give you one last chance. Give up right now and I'll let you join up with us for real. Our public image could use a child sidekick. I can't join you because the real funky force died with Joe! <laughs> Ari? Uh, what are you uh, screaming about? <laughs> Partner! I... Was stealing. What? No, I wasn't! Oh, then what's this, little man? I didn't take this well, I did, but that's not why I was here! Partner, they're frogs! They're funky, framing frogs, and... Okay, Ori. I understand what's going on. Oh, thanks, Shemad, you believe? You're jealous. What? No, I'm not jealous, I... Like I said, we've had a very long week, and you're meeting your heroes, and it hasn't really gone as planned. You're having a freak out. I get it. Yeah, just go home, deputy. You look like you're gonna drop dead right here. Do you think he'll be okay? Maybe I should go after him. Why would you care? The useless kid was spoiling your precious vacation anyway. No, he wasn't. He was... Wait, why can I see you right now? Uh, oh, I was in that food. You know, if you ever just listen to other people, maybe your life wouldn't be as terrible as it is right now. Oh, don't freak out, Maggie. We're gonna help you relax. You know, help you empty your head. Hey, hey! What are you doing? Walked away, kid. Now you get front row seats for what happens next. Keep them here. Hello, Port Aurora! As you know, we have a very special performer with us tonight. May I introduce the winner of our dance competition, Maggie Splitzer! Funky Force's newest player! But first, I have a special heart-stopping performance for... The Mayor! Maggie, please, snap out of... Well, I'm sure we'd love to see that. And since the town deputy is here too, why don't we let him sit in as well? You're up, girl. Knock him dead. DJ, spin that funky track! Destroy the evil, destroy the evil, destroy the evil, destroy! Ah, 
didn't know this performance had audience interaction. Mr. Mayor, I'm trying to tell you! This is not a performance! Your life is in danger! <sighs> Mr. Mayor, get behind me! But I can't see the show! Just get behind me! Girl! Ah! Uh! No choice but to face the music, huh? Well, partner. Let's owe you on this one. Anytime, partner. Actually, you can pay me back right now by saving us from the homicidal supervillains! No one interrupts our show, kid. My friends! Things are worse than we feared! Even this girl is working with a dastardly deputy to destroy the mayor and this show! What? No, that's not true! The Funky Force hypnotized me with funky rhythms! They're evil! Musical hypnotism? Who would even think of something that dumb? I believe the Funky Force! We should blame all this on those two! The boy locked my cart, and she conked me a telephone! Both of them are evil! Ugh. I knew I shouldn't have started Free Torch Day. You can win the fight, kids. But you can't win the crowd. Uh. <laughs> hey, boss! We're ready for the... Sir, mission accomplished. Guys, long enough. <laughs> no wonder you couldn't cut it as superheroes. You can't even frame a couple of kids. Well, I guess I'll take it from here now. <laughs> and you'll keep your end of the bargain? Oh, don't worry. Your friend's family will be well taken care of. They're not going to want for anything for the rest of their lives. <sighs> Ha <laughs> ha 
Can I have that back? No! The evil ones have stolen my dogs now, too! You might need a bigger cell there, deputy. I don't think this one can hold the whole town. Quiet, you! Just get back in the vacuum clean- Wait a second. Hey, who let you out? Well, let's just say the deputy is not the only one with a supervisor. Well, well, well. We finally meet face to face. No, no, down here. Ori, is my brain still messed up or is that egg talking to us? No, I see. I am not an egg! Good shot, goody one. Have a treat. Hello, deputy. My name's Benedict. You don't know me, but your family and I go way back. Pop Pop's ashes! No! Hurry! <laughs> ah, funnily enough, ashes are the reason I got into a scuffle with your grandfather 100 years ago as well. I know who you are now. I've heard stories about you. You're the one that killed my pop-up! <laughs> yes, that was me. But not before he managed to seal me inside this useless egg-shaped prison of a body. But once I steal the ashes this time, I'll finally have the power to undo your grandfather's curse and return to my full glory. Not if we stop you here. <laughs> Come on, time to boogie! Coming! Just have to lock up before we leave. Goonie. <laughs> Goonie too! Bring in the parting gift, would you? We'll see you later, deputy! No, we won't, man. She's gonna die in like a minute. Hey, guys! If you let us out, I'll give you a full pardon on your crimes! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Whisk, you said you don't want to be a criminal anymore, right? Well, start by letting us out of here! I am a criminal. You should know. You're the one who locked me up. <laughs> <laughs> as much as I would have liked to torment the both of you more, I'm afraid that our relationship, much like the two of you, is going to be rather short-lived. <laughs> Can't die here! Porter Brewer needs me! Step aside! I got this, Ori! Got them! Ah, fireworks. Always a good way to start a festival. Are you going to 
pay for that egg? <sighs> Come on, man. We just saved your life. All right, all right. <sighs> Thank you, though. Maybe we were wrong. Maybe you are not such a bad deputy and ginger girl after all. Ice cream for sale! Now we're street duppings! Thanks for not leaving me, Ori. Thanks for helping me be a better deputy. <laughs> the Borealis Lighthouse. It's lit. We're running out of time! Well then, what are we waiting for? Let's go, partner. <gasps> Woohoo! We're partners again! Woohoo! <laughs> yeah! Wow! <laughs> we told you, stupid Boris. Break curfew, we'll break your skulls. If you have trouble sleeping, we can put you down for a long time. Sue, time for a trash pickup. <laughs> ah. No, please, I'm sorry. Hey, someone else breaking curfew out there. I swear we're going to. Ah! Mash, go check it out! <laughs> it's okay, Mash. Ghosts are super weak to guns. Everybody knows that. Ah! All right, Duke, listen up. I'm warning you, whoever you are, we're under the protection of Sheriff Benedict. Didn't you hear? There's a new sheriff in town. And their name is us! Wait, that wasn't right. You two survived, huh? Well, that don't matter. Just gives me a chance to finish you myself! <laughs> Time to talk, Tater Tot. Oh. Hmm. All right, you four. We don't have a lot of time, so spill it! How do we get into the lighthouse? Ha! Joke's on you! We're not smart enough to know that! Yeah, big man's got security there, thicker than Duke's head! No way you idiots are getting in! I think he's telling the truth, partner. About the security, not us being idiots. Maybe the mayor can help? He was supposed to lead the parade to the lighthouse! He probably knows a bunch of ways to get in! Well, doesn't sound like we have a better option right now. Thanks. Thanks for coming back to save us. Sorry for the whole forming an angry mob thing. Uh, happens to everyone. Are you all gonna be okay with handling these guys? Don't worry. Our citizens will take it from here. <laughs> so. When the Big Egg was genetically engineering you guys, did he just forget to give you brains, or what? Trapped! We have to get in silently, otherwise they'll tip off Benedict about us! Okay, hold this rope. I'll steal her laser so we can cut through the window. Are you guys even guys? Let's maybe get some diversity here. How you been? You're still breathing? Goni! Let's- No, oh, just take it already! Hey, no! Get back here with my mask! No!
go, Joe. Still got the moves, baby. Uh, hello, fellas. Happy Phoenix Festival to you. Phoenix Festival's been canceled, Mayor. You uh, of all people should know that. Oh, uh, Benedict. Uh, I mean, Sheriff Benedict. He wanted to see me in the lighthouse, so, uh... uh you get one chance to dance, Mr. Mayor. Tell us where they're hiding, and you get to go back to your office mostly in one piece. Um, you see, I, uh, oh, hey, oh, hey, ha, huh? okay, back of the van! They're in the back of the van! What in the funk? Better go catch a flunky fish. We'll save a dance for you later, baby. Uh, funky horse, boogie down and roll out. They're gaining on us, sorry. Got any ideas, Mr. Funky Force expert? According to the Funky Force fact book, the van should have some weapons on board. It's how they defeated Count Trucula. The, the controls must be around here somewhere. <laughs> Ah! Ah, running out of time, Ori! Hey, Funky Driver! Do you want to activate Funk Truck Defense Mode? Ah! Yes! Activate Defense Mode! Right on! Then just please say the password now! Uh... Funk? Password accepted! Defense Mode engaged! Our security system! It really wasn't that hard! Doesn't matter, boys! That's our band! We know all the steps! My turn on the dance floor. All right, boys, let's up the tempo. Kids are in luck. You get to see our signature move. Time for the big finale! Ori, get us out of here! There's nowhere to go! Funk and Flash! Mind if I cut into this dance? His duty, Ori. Now we have to do ours. We won't forget you, Mr. Mayor. So, what's the mayor's actual name anyway? Finding that out will be our next case. Right after we take care of Benedict. I'm not dead! Oh, whoops. <coughs> Boy, listen. There's something important I have to tell you. 
This is a top. Why didn't you start with that? <laughs> What's wrong, deputy? You said you wanted me to face you myself. Well, here I am. I even brought an audience. Ori, I'm coming! You're wasting time. That door will only open for the badge of the sheriff. But I have to get up there and help my partner! Listen to me, lass. You have to get the phoenix egg away from that madman. We need the phoenix egg to hatch out in the open. I know. My partner and I will... This is more important than the boy. If the time comes, and you have to choose, save the egg. Without its energy, death and ruin will come to this island for a hundred years! Just get out of here, old timer. I'll worry about the rest. You know, when I came here 100 years ago, yeah, I wasn't looking for anything special, just a phoenix egg, so I could steal its power and become immortal. <laughs> but instead, your grandfather cursed me like this. Do you know what he took from me? I wasn't just a genius. I had strength beyond reckoning. <laughs> Gangs would fall before me after a single demonstration of my strength. I was on the verge of having a criminal empire that would last an eternity! <laughs> but when this egg cracks open, I'll siphon all its wonderful energy out, <laughs> regain my strength, and my empire will rise from the ashes once more! <laughs> hey, Benedict! Speaking of ashes, I'm going to make a few of my own right now! Cuties! You monsters! I spent like a whole afternoon trading those guys! Well, at least you'll have something to do before the next Phoenix Festival! Ah! Get back here with my egg, boy! Ori, hold on! I'm coming! You think you can run, boy? I still got more than enough backup power to kill you! Save the Phoenix Egg. 
save Ori. I can do both! Take it easy, partner. I'm not letting anyone else die while I'm around. Hey, Benedict! Don't count your phoenixes before they hatch! I don't know why you're upset. He said he always wanted to be like his grandfather, and now he is. Dead! <laughs> Ah, Whisk, you decided to show up to work. I thought I was going to have to cut your pay. Blame them. They got me caught up in a wild crow chase. I'm warning you, Whisk. Get out of here before I kick your ass! Well, that's an interesting offer. But unless you can beat his one of wiping my debts clean, I'm going to have to pass. where the phoenix ashes come from. A place between life and death that opens up every hundred years. <gasps> Partner! <laughs> Maggie, you have to get out of there, please! I'm not worth dying over! So it's all right for you to die for her, but not the other way around? I didn't mean it like that. I mean, I'm just a kid and she... Cares about you. I wish I had a partner like that back in the day. But I was too proud and stubborn. Yeah, I was manly and well respected, but no one liked me. I died on the top of this lighthouse. Alone. But you got people that care about you and look out for you. You are worth a lot more to other people alive than dead. <sighs> now, boy. Quit crying, shut up, and let someone make a sacrifice for you for once. Perfect Maggie. Hero Maggie. Yet how many people around you have to die because you just want good enough? No, uh, I try, but... People give everything for you, and what do you ever do in return? Nag and complain and boss them around! You're useless. Mm, real talk, you've actually managed to impress me, girl. 
Maybe, in another life, you could have been a pretty useful henchwoman. Last chance, Maggie. You don't need to die here. <sighs> Just run away. I'm not going to leave. Not when someone needs me! skills, never wrestle a dynamite shark, and you can't grow a beard, what for? But you already got the only thing a sheriff needs. A really big hat? No, boy. You got a desire to protect people. Now get out there and protect your partner. Thanks, Pop-Pop. I'll make you proud. You already have, Sheriff. All the getting hit in the face. You want pain? Because I've got a lot to share with you, you idiot, aggravating, meddlesome, insignificant children! You think you've stopped me? No. You've just sent me back another hundred years and filled me with more murderous rage than I ever felt before! Whisk! Prepare to kill some rats! Get up and fight, you coward! Otherwise, once I'm done with these two, I will have your mother pay your debt for you. Just give up and run away, Whisk. This isn't your fight. Yeah, we'll make sure Benedict doesn't get a chance to hurt anyone. <laughs> you, you don't pay me enough for this! <laughs> Looks like you're alone, Benedict. Yeah, you failed! Just like last Phoenix Festival! Don't forget, kids. There's another thing that happened that night. I also killed a sheriff! <laughs> Come on, 
By the power vested in me as Sheriff of Port Aurora! You! Hot under arrest! Sheriff? No! Stay back! You're not sealing me away again! Throne! Emergency eject! Benedict, stop! You're trying to blow! You'll never get me! Never! <laughs> You okay, Ori? Yeah, I'm alive at least. Wow, it's beautiful. Ah, Port Aurora is safe again. Sorry about the lighthouse. It's okay, we have another hundred years to fix it. <laughs> <laughs> Is in this stupid party, and we have to pick up this stupid trash. Why can't we join in? Yeah, we only ever did attempted murder. We never actually managed to kill anyone. You know, that's a pretty fresh sound. We've been looking for a new music producer. You free after this? You know what? I oh, am. Yeah. No music collaborations until this beach is spotless! <laughs> <sighs> so, Sheriff Thory, you finally get the badge, and the first thing you do is take a beach break? Hey, I wanted to give you at least one day of vacation before you ship back home tomorrow. Oh, don't worry. I'll be back sometime. How can I stay away? This place is a real sunset paradise. Ice cream! Ooh, over here! Two Wembems for heroes, okay? These guys are great! They just work for whoever yells loudest! Oh, shells, I forgot something. Uh, I'll be right back! <laughs> <sighs> So, did this trip actually make a difference? Yeah, it did. I learned a lot about myself, and I think I know what I want to do with my life now. I just want to help people. People that can't help themselves. <laughs> Sounds like someone we know. <sighs> so, partner, I got this for you as a going away present. Sorry your old camera broke, but hey, you can fill this one with a whole bunch of new memories. Aw, thanks, Ori. Say, Phoenix Festival! Phoenix Festival! Ah, uh, where am I? Ah, ah, ah. Whisk, whisk, hey! Huh? Mm. Ah. No, 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 no! Wes, get back here, you stammering simpleton! Ah! All right, Benedict, you got this. Not like you haven't got a lot worse before. You are a genius, and there's no problem you cannot solve. Oh, I don't know about that, Benny boy. <laughs> I'd say you got one heck of a problem. <laughs> ah!